So what's it like now? And because uh, a friend of mine went uh, went there last year, and he said, well, it's you can still see it, but it's it's coming. It's getting a lot better, you know. I mean, I think a lot was learned from it, and and a lot of precautions are now being taken in case it happens again, you know. God forbid. But uh, you know, like a hundred years from now, probably. Yeah. Something catastrophic like that will hit. Yeah. You know, we have hurricanes all the time that, that go through, and mostly in Florida and stuff like that. But this one centralized so strong. Right there in the Gulf, dude. You know, right there in the Gulf. And it, the water was so hot that it was, you know. I live in Texas, so I, I kind of, I'm familiar with that. I grew up on the beach down in the Gulf, you know. Um, well, you felt the effects summer. of Rita, the one that came right after. Yeah, that that messed y'all up, man. And but it seems like there there are there are more now, the last ten years or so. Yeah. Uh, is it true, or I mean, if we if we look at the news over here, then we think, well, it's more. I think two or three years ago, you had thirteen or something. Yeah, you're getting in a one season. Snowstorm, you freak out. Um, but it, that's just the it's, way that that's where it is. It's, that's yeah. Mother nature, I'm pretty Yeah, uh, we can't do nothing to shut about that. Um, so, but how did it affect the album then? I mean, lyric-wise, did you did you talk about the lyrics and, and say, well, maybe we should Philip write a song the about? It's his ball game. It's so you, if he comes in with a lyric, do you do you do you know what it's about, or is it just well, he just sings and you you create your own imagery or? Yeah, I, I think it's up for your own in interpretation. And I, just I like you would say like any other, any band, you know. You would. No, but it could be because you, because you play the songs too, and maybe you will saying, "Well, uh, I would like to know what the song is about because m maybe I can do something with my drumming yeah, or course. bass playing." So that's yeah, but it's not. It, that's it, not how that's we approach his, it, though. His dep you know, it's like me and Jimmy hook up, and we try to get the bass and drums as solid as we can, you know. And so we leave. Philip writes all the lyrics. They're his personal from personal experience and strengths and, and uh, experiences that that's his deal. So, you know, you're talking to the rhythm dicks here. I know. <laughs> you know. No, it could be because sometimes, well, maybe maybe you were saying, well, I really would like to know what the song is about. Some of them are quite obvious, you know, and then others, you know, I, I kind of leave it to my own interpretation. Because it's like reading a book, you know, it, um, a lot of people have different opinions, you know. But, so I just leave it at that. We're not make, making a political statement. We're not, you know, this is just for personal experience. But I, I, I really think so. If you leave it up to, to your own interpretation of what it is, you can grab it from all kinds of different things. But the whole record is in a positive tone. You know, there's not. He could have been bummed out of his gourd, which which he was. But you know, he he wrote really really strong positive things through this. But I can imagine that, that, that the music is, is, is also uh, different then, because if you play music to lyrics that are negative, more negatively, or doesn't, doesn't it, it affect you? I mean, the lyrics, if you know it's positive or maybe negative, or well, it's we, a, we write the music first. Yeah, okay. And, and, uh, then, and, then, then, and then he... The lyrics come okay, out. And then right. he, and then he, okay.